Hey everyone, it's Ivan, KitPatcher.com, out here to go over the idea of talking about something versus being about something. In this amazing day and age of social media, there's a lot of people that want to talk about a lot of things, and when push comes to shove, actions don't necessarily match up with the words. A lot of people want to talk about it, not a lot of people want to actually be about it. Wonderful quote, probably paraphrasing at this point, from our friend Clint Smith. Everyone wants to be John Wayne till it's time to do John Wayne shit. Pretty true. What are some examples? Literally all over the place, throw a rock, you'll find one. A great one is you'll see people with their shirts they're rocking, stickers, bumper stickers, whatever it is. Kill your local pedophile. Quick aside. I think pedophiles are 100% just broken people. They have no place in society. Do I think they should be killed? I don't know, story for another time. And there's the legality of following through with that murder. But you'll have people that are yeah, rocking those shirts, rocking those stickers, throwing it up on their social media stuff. That's cool. But there's literally a map that shows where all of them are. So what are you doing? Again, not encouraging people to go do violent crimes. I just appreciate the irony. What are other examples? Well, maybe Russia, Ukraine, Israel, Palestine. Did I miss anyone or have I offended everyone at this point? Well, let me tell you a quick story. Back in the olden days, the early days of the GWAT, Global War on Terror, for kids that are unfamiliar with that, there, well, I was over in Camp Rhino down in southern Afghanistan, basically, airfield out in the middle of nowhere. It was our first toehold in Afghanistan when everything kind of kicked off. This was December 2001, something like that. And if you want, whole series of float tapes pretty interesting looking back on that history now but someone ended up coming through our camp after being captured a guy by the name of john walker lynn he basically spent a night in that winter in the desert in a conex box pretty sure basically duct taped to a cot with bullet wound shrapnel something like that before he eventually was sent back out to the mew eventually stateside to get prosecuted. When the war first kicked off, he's like, man, I'm with the Taliban. And he literally ended up going to Afghanistan to fight America on the side of the Taliban. Do I think he made the right choice? Probably not, as evidenced by how that kind of ended up playing out for him. And honestly, I just don't think Taliban were kind of on the right side of that fence either. But do you know what he didn't do? He didn't post a Taliban flag in his profile. Sorry, not sorry. I already sense all the angry typing and rationalization going on. Well, I, but I, no, but nothing. You're saying you believe so strongly in something that you're not willing to inconvenience yourself. You're just gonna like, cool, like here's a flag. I'm with these guys. Awesome virtue signaling. Well, I'm bringing awareness. Oh yeah, because no one is aware of any of the global events. Like, good on you. you. Managed to argue online with some people that think differently. Awesome. Talk about it or be about it. Oh, I'm past my prime or they won't let me go pull a trigger. Oh, cool, go find an aid station. Go wash wounds. Or do you like the idea of supporting something versus actually supporting something? Because when it comes down to it, realistically, there are very few things that you really and truly care about. Ivan, you're just a hypocrite. Maybe, I don't know. There's very few things I openly talk about and express my position on. One of the few ones is honestly, fatherhood and doing a good job as a father working towards rather because absolutely fall short on occasion but working towards being a good father to raise good strong young men 
and yeah i probably more often than not like my actions actually line up with that and i do what i can in my world to hopefully yeah, show people things that are hopefully worth emulating if they have young kids so like again one of the few things i will actually talk about and i would like to think actions actually back up so where does that bring us where do we go from here start yeah. maybe just shut your mouth if you take offense to that maybe we're talking about you and if you don't then probably aren't talking about you but just because the internet gave you a voice doesn't mean you really need to chime in on everything granted there are some things that might be important to you but do you move the needle by talking about those things or do you move the needle by actually doing those things way of example be talking to this person they really want to make this massive impact with respect to basically cleaning the world up environmental stuff all that and i'm like that is really cool and they're like yeah like i we just need a really and i'm like hold on stop for a second when was the last time you just like walked down the street or went to a park and just picked up some of the trash locally oh you haven't oh so you're really passionate about this thing but you refuse to actually act in accordance with all those words just spilling out of your mouth they don't line up but at the end of the day like freedom internet you do you am i saying there's no place for being vocal about something absolutely not most certainly a time and place but comma talking about it versus being about it are two different things and usually if you want to move the needle i would suggest be about it and with that in mind very quickly you will realize that there are very few things in your life that you're willing to actually be about a lot of people talk about a lot of things think of it as currency like you can talk about all these things dilute it throw it all out there or you can pull all that together and go all in on the thing that's actually important which is more realistically where people stand i've yet to meet someone that really believes in all of these things so strongly and then actually does nothing about any of those that like that is most people honestly really quick to tell you about the things that are important also the last person you'll ever see doing something about those things weird but at the end of the day man you do you and as always thanks for joining us at kitbadger.com look forward to seeing you next time